Hi guys, I'm uh, Damien Jordan, uh, kite designer at Nash Kiteboarding, and I'm here in England with the uh, king of water sports guys to uh, talk a little bit about what's new for the 2011 torch. Um, 2011 torch, what we've done was uh, working with our top team riders we have, Kevin Langry, Sam Light, Rio Stevens, and all the other riders that ride on the torch, and uh, we get to such a fine level of uh, design with that kite, we can actually work on each size uh, really independently and it's really based off the inputs from each team rider on each side so uh, what we've done this year for like the 12 and the 14 was focusing on uh, making them faster turning and also more solid in the air so it's, it's, it's a stronger kite in the air with like even crisper feel in the bar and it turns a lot, lot faster uh, then the smaller size the 6, 7, 8, 9 will be focused with like kind of getting them a little slower but on the same time um, more solid in the air. Uh, that was with the introduction of a solid uh, frame construction. Um, yeah. And what you get out of that is you get a kite that handles even better the strong wind. And uh, that was that was the main focus. And then for the size in the middle, uh, the 11, the 10, uh, the idea was like just making them more solid in the air, but keeping the same kind of bar feel, speed, uh, and uh, turning speed. So uh, that was really the main focus. And what's new also for this year is that we've introduced uh, five meter. Um, but uh, so who, some people wonder who they should buy the torch. Some people think it's too high end for them. But one of the things we really focus on the torch is to keep it easy, because uh, even though you're Kevin Langery and you're pulling amazing tricks, you want a kite that handles the strong wind, handles the gust, uh, and has a lot of deep power. So even though it's a five line kite, it has a lot of deep power. The kite shoots really far forward in the window. So when you overpower it, you just edge a little bit, and the kite flies there, and you're like in control again so uh, the torch you know obviously is really good uh, unhook right uh, unhook riding kite but also pretty versatile and uh, can handle a lot of conditions so uh, don't get don't get scared by the torch you can try it and you're gonna you're really gonna like it for now yeah. uh, sucked a little bit I can do the last the last yeah cutting. so the torch is a really good unhook riding kite but also really easy to ride uh, in any condition and probably the easiest sea kite you can find on the market. It's not like a big truck, it's a really easy kite. So get on the torch, try it, you're gonna like it.